Okay, so uh, let's talk about that sinkhole that everyone likes to talk about at one time. Sinkhole and micro sinkhole. Well, let's look at this footage right here. These are the firemen attempting to rescue the lady. The dog. Trying to save a lady trapped inside. Look at the firemen standing in all that water. Huh. We'll see how it goes, man. Wait a minute. Hopefully we Wait get a minute. there. Hold on. Look at the firemen standing in all that water. Huh. Well, we can say one thing, the sinkhole wasn't right there, they'd be standing in water, wouldn't they? They'd be stand they would not be standing in water. They would be standing in a sinkhole, right? Alright. Also, if there's a sinkhole there, the fire meant that water wouldn't be there, would it? Unless by chance all that water filled up the sinkhole, however you imagine it. It filled up the sinkhole and now it's at this level. And the water finds level, right? So Water finds level. You put a, you know, you pour water into one container, they attach, they will find the level from one tank to the other tank. People are saying this is ocean water. Well, they, they can clearly determine if that's ocean water. The fireman can tell you it's salt water or not. So this, this is probably that broken pipe. Timeline-wise, I don't know how large the footprint is that this water would be holding. We know it's not the swimming pool. I showed you in a previous video. The swimming pool is full. I did that for a reason to show you that. That's a lot of water in that basement. Now, some of that water displaced by the materials that are in the, on the floor. So let's, uh, I add, you know, eight inches of water in the bathtub. I climb into the bathtub. The water elevation changes up. A big fat person climbs in the same bathtub and the water, and the water overflows the bathtub. I'm sorry guys, I'm in, I'm in the health and I try to, you know, be facetious and try to help people understand that, you know, that, some fat's okay, really. I, I can prove that in my nutrition um, background. But the uh, so you get this this water level at this height. But remember, you have a lot of materials in inside the floor there that would displace and make the water higher than normal. So just because we see it up to their ankles, you can't don't assume that that the water is at that height. Hey, I, f I see a Biden Harris sticker in front of me. A little teeny one on a car. Biden Harris something. I can't make it out. What does it say at the top there? Uh, well, that's it. Uh, Biden's white and Harris is in blue, so I guess that's the uh, colors of the of the uh, party. Look, all that stuff's a scam. They're all the same. They both want to tear down the United States. Both of them. Both parties. The both parties. Hell, all parties. All of them want power. Back to this damn video. Look, the firemen didn't were not able to save her. You know, of course, it was your grandmother or something. You'd be quite upset. Let's put it relative to time of life. I don't know how old that person was, but, you know, they, they, they deserve to live if they wanted to live, right? That, that's the thing of that. But when we get at a certain age, we're on our last 10 years, this one guy said, this, this guy, he was a real rich guy, I remember him. He says, you know what, it, he said, you know what it's great about being 90 years old? And uh, he answers his own question. And he says, I know that I'm pretty much counting down from 10 now. I know this is my last 10, and I probably won't make it out of a, at, you know, to the 100. So I'm living my life maxed out now, screaming at, screaming at the walls when they were uh, saying, why are you doing that? And he was like, basically, hey, I, I know I got 10 years left. And it's, it's just getting, you know, it's, it theoretically should be getting worse every year. You know, the, each, each, each year I knock off should be a little less improvement on my health, is what, is what he stated. So I know that's an odd thing to say or but if I'm 90 and I'm trapped in a building, you leave my ass in there, all right? If I'm 88, leave me in there. Don't 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 risk your lives. You guys are young and healthy. You know what? Don't don't do it. Don't do it. If I'm screaming for you to come and help me, you do the math. Are you gonna? You have a family and everything else. I only got a few years left in my ass at that point if I'm lucky. So you're gonna save me, and then I die three years later. But your family's without you for 50 years you know, your grandkids and everything else. You're gonna to attempt to save me. So I know I talk bad about the firemen also, but I'll also say that sometimes you just gotta do the math, you know, you gotta do the math. Some people aren't, aren't, you can't save everyone. You know, anyone who's a lifeguard knows that two people are drowning, you go out and you save one. You don't try to save them both because uh, you're gonna, all three of you are gonna drown. So you, you, you grab one. You, there's no way you're gonna teach the two of them to grab hold of a rag a towel, you would throw them both, theoretically, you could throw them both for your shirt. They could both grab your shirt and you could tow them in, if you, depending how far you are. 
but uh, you, you're not going to grab each one individually and, and, and try to bring them in. You can attempt to tow them if they would help kick and everything else, and you guys knew that you know you could get to land or to some surface in short order. Otherwise, you got three dead, three dead people. Again, this is about the water, sinkholes. Um, okay, so the piles appear not to have been that deep at all. I, I was informed that that Hawaii, 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 uh, Miami is uh, pretty shallow in their depth. So I did put a video talking about the 175, but I said that it was a building that was at that location that they went down. They, it's like the engineer demanded to go down to make, break a record. 175 I think it was I found it somewhere and I said other buildings have gone down to 125 that's all I said I never said this building went down in there I said they needed to reach a certain uh, compressive force before they stopped and that's all I said and it might be only four feet it might be five feet hell so uh, but we don't have um, a settlement across the entire structure because we got too many piers that would that would have to settle equally again that water is it salt water they're standing in or is it fresh water the firemen know um, also the the materials that fell down displaced it and make it look higher than it is the uh, that you can hear it sounds like flowing water still in the background so it sounds like it's a broken uh, broken pipe that's my bias I hear that uh, that I hear that sounds like water flowing. Playing video. You hear it behind the walls, so we're digging her out. Trying to save a lady trapped inside. We'll see how it goes, man. Hopefully, we get there. We can hear her behind the walls, so we're digging her out. Trying to save a lady trapped inside. All right, subsequently, um, I think a fire started and she probably died of uh, smoke inhalation. Um, so they tried. Now, you know, I, I, I said something and they didn't support it properly and everything else. They're too, too, uh, too, maybe too ambitious to, instead of uh, securing the building first before diving into shark infested waters. That is that the, 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 the roof above them could have collapsed on them. So yes, I see why they need engineers to come there and supervise. I can't give away the rest of the story, but I retract my negative comment about the engineers I made uh, many, many videos ago, maybe five videos back saying those engineers, what are they, uh, whatever they may be, they're backing, you know, they're not there, they're not in the mix. I retract that statement with my new knowledge of what, of how they get hold of the engineers to assist, to assist um, in in these in these uh, in the, at these locations. So I, ret I retract that. I, I can't exactly say why, but I but I understand the uh, the limitations of their assistance of the engineers that they get for assistance. I understand that no insult on any engineer that that, that assisted there. Um, I understand your your intent and your heart and everything else. Oh, and definitely not insulting anyone that called me or contacted me, rather. N no way. I'm just saying that, um, that, uh, you know, you're not, I don't think, I don't think the engineers were down there with those firemen. I think those firemen, that's what I think. Those firemen made that decision by themselves to go underneath that column and to support it as they did. Um, and so, you know, they, they're rushing to get somebody out of a burning building, if you will. So that, that's my position. Take care, guys. And uh, I don't know how to end this video. Let's see if I can do this as a screen recording. So I go to screen recording, and then I press X. Take care, guys.